won the election. They took me to court and I won. I am proud of myself. Tunimbo Brax, welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Please subscribe to our channel. To get notified when we we'll post hot juicy news updates, please click on the notification bell. President Bola Tunimbo has again expressed his satisfaction with the outcome of the 2023 presidential election in Nigeria. The president who contested and won the February 25th, 2023 election on the platform of the All Progressive Congress, APC, said he is proud of what he achieved. He added that he could not have achieved it without the help and support of those who believed in him and voted for him. According to him, he is proud of winning the 2023 presidential and presidential election and also defeating the People's Democratic Party, okay, and also defeating Atiku Obobaka of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, and P2B of the Labour Party, LP, who challenged his victory up to the Supreme Court. I am proud standing before you. I am very proud of everyone, you, every one of you, and I'm proud of myself too. I went for election. I went for an election and won with your support. They took me to court and I won, the president said. Now, <laughs> I cannot imagine what people are going to be saying about this. <laughs> hey, my goodness. So, hmm. so the man is saying he's proud eh, of coming out to win election. Well, I knew that. See, I saw this coming. Sincerely, when he said Tunubu is the master strategy, it was a thing of he will win or he will not win. And what happened? He, I mean, he will win and he will not win. And at the end of the day, he won. But if you notice, he no say Nigerians, no be all Nigerians vote for him. He said people that voted for me. You saw those things they used to come and say Nigerians, they voted for me. Mm -mm. They no waiting, they do say. Remember before elections, pre-election period, I think a few weeks to election, I came out and I was saying, hmm. the way where these APC people, they use, they portray themselves, they are not coming out to say Nigerians will vote for them. They are not making that kind of a statement. You know, I was like, what are these people up to that time? We I not to say the day of the new plan that there has been an election. And also that time, I remember I was saying that we should not forget that winning an election and Giving good governance or good leadership is two, there are two different things. That is what is we are saying now. See, because before you get into that seat, just like everyone now, you are not the president, mm -hmm. you are the citizen. You are going to come in, you are going to say a lot of things. From outside, you'll be seeing a lot of wrongs. You'll be seeing a lot of wrongs. You'll be seeing how you, for your mind, you'll be like, why are they not doing things like this, like that? You'll be able to, you know, give in. But when you get there, Omo, you're going to notice, say, let me say it be, as in, that thing that you are looking from down, that it is easy. When you come close to it, it is not that easy. But still on still, still on that, you try as much as possible to ensure that what happens that is why I am of the opinion that I don't mind having a president who is not known everywhere. Somebody who is a nobody becoming the president of Nigeria is what I'm looking up to. You know why? Number one, it will mean that the people voted him there. The people voted him in. Number two, because the people voted him in, he's not going to owe anybody anything. He will not come in and say, People will work for me. Let me give them ministerial appointments. Let me share the money for them or with them. He's not going to do that at all. He will come in with the mindset of, I come to work and he will start working. He will hit the ground running. Congratulations once again, President Tunumbu Ahmed Adekunli. You shall succeed in your endeavors by the grace of God Almighty. Amen. No. We the Igbos are proud of you and we thank you for making Lagos a business hub for all of us to make money. At least Ifan Yuba from South has said it and Dagode from the Southwest said it too during the commission of his refinery. Okay. 
My own is, ah, of course now, hell, hell yourself. They say even lizard self gone. If nobody heal you, heal yourself. Lizard will be seen an animal. He fall from up. As you reach ground, he do it in. He not here. Say yes, I try. <laughs> Alright, but me, I'm coming out to say, oh, now, no, this thing where they come as I can't hit. Can't do King Kong, King Kong. Nobody in Nigerians want. In fact, to me, you're not even supposed to come out to even say this. Why? Because the lot is at stake, sir. This time where you come out, you to congratulate yourself. Now, I'm not saying you should not congratulate yourself. You can look yourself in the American. But, Oga, as a member of the um, Citizens Association of Nigeria, Oga, this thing where they do, you waste time, sir. Go look, uh, go to find how you go use, do our monetary policies, revive our economy. And stop the insecurity. Stop the fighting here and there. Stop the mine as in the illegal mine going on in this country. Stop all the places, all the holes. We will say money they use fly come off our coffers. We will not know about. That is what Nigerians want. That is why you are coming to beat your chest like King Kong. Fight never starts in the big chest. Come winning the election is one thing. The two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten thing. You never do one, sir. So it is for me, you get 1 over 10. 1 over 10 is you still need to work hard. You still need to come in. You still need to work. You still need to make sure that you are able to, permit me to use the word, do well. Impress the citizens of Nigeria. Yes, you did not come into the right way, but can, can these politicians, can they impress us? You understand? Make somebody maybe say, yes, you know, come in through the right source, but the person come in and things start going well. That is how... Nigeria says, good day. wow, this man upon say this man no waka in way no pure. I think before he enter, but he enter there, things come they happen. That is the kind of news Nigeria was not this your King Kong, not this vision of chess you're doing to say, yes, you won, you won. Of course, you did win, but we have to see whether really, really you will win Nigerians over. It is one thing to win the, the particular political seat, and it's another thing to win the people of Nigeria's heart over. Okay. Everybody here. Okay, you are very sincere. I said.